This is my 2011 Nissan Versa, and this is my CB radio setup that I have going on here. It's a pretty simple setup, not really anything special. It's got a Cobra 19 Ultra 3, bought it at Walmart for about 35 bucks. Not a bad price for a pretty good radio. Not the best radio in the world, it's only got three controls here, squelch volume and the uh, channel button right here, you just uh, flip it back and forth, obviously. And also has two buttons here. What that does is you can uh, hook this up to a PA system. I have not installed a PA system, but uh, you can also filter it through your aux jack if you have one in your car or truck or whatever. And it'll actually play through the speakers here. And it comes with this mic right here, really fat mic. Uh, I put it on my little lid thing here because I really don't want to drill anything in my car uh, to put the bracketing on. Uh, I know I could probably put like a Velcro thing on there and like just like hang it there. Uh, but for the time being, I'm just hanging it right there, you know. Not the most secure place for it. It does fall down a lot, but you know, you get over it. Pretty easy to handle. Not bad at all. You're just. Hello, how are you doing? You know, shit like that. Like that. And the power source I got going for it is this really cool little cigarette lighter adapter deal here. I just unplug it. I got this at Radio Shack for about seven bucks. And what you do is you take little red and black cords here and you put them in these little cap things. You just twist them down and you got power. It's pretty nice, I think. Pretty simple as well. Uh, although I have heard if you use the cigarette lighter instead of actually filtering it through your radio system, you will get like unnecessary noise from your car, like weather and your acceleration and all that good stuff, uh, which I have experienced. I have heard my own acceleration on my radio. Oh, by the way, this radio comes with a speaker. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but it's got little holes down there. That's a speaker. You can also hook it up to your car speakers, uh, which I did not do because I don't really see the point, in my opinion. But if you want to do that, that's all up to you, buddy. So, uh, what good is a CB radio without a CB radio antenna? Which I have, right here. Filtering through my little uh, weather sealant thing here. Going all the way down. To the back, I don't know if you can, yeah, right there. You can see it. Then I have it filtering through the middle of the seat here into my radio. Pretty nice, if you ask me. Pretty low profile. And the kind of antenna that I have is a magnet mount. This is a Lil Will from Wilson. It gets about 300 watts. Very, very powerful magnet. Got very long whip here. And it just goes down into my car. Now this was the old antenna that I had. This is the old antenna that I bought at Walmart for about, uh, about 15, 16 bucks. I don't really know the exact price. But uh, not bad, not bad if you ask me. Not the best either, but it's decent. But uh, it's just a cheapo little thing. It's also a magnet mount, pretty powerful as well. Rain, sleet, snow, it's been through a lot over the past month or two. And I just keep it back here in case my Wilson breaks. Or maybe if my brother or my father or some, someone wants to get into CB radio, you know, I'll give him this. You know, it's good to keep old stuff. You never know when you might need it for backup. Let's see if we can get a good signal over on the interstate. The interstate's about that way, so I'm gonna head over there. Here we go! And here we are, the interstate. Well, this isn't the interstate. The interstate is actually back there. You can see it. And we're going to test out our radio here. Here we go. Flip it on by turning the volume button on. Mannequin with a black wig, a 
and you call it your mommy. Oh, the glorious sounds of the CD radio. Okay, that's enough. All right, uh, well, you get the idea. Pretty good radio, pretty good signal from the antenna. I do highly recommend both of them. And I just uh, thought this would be a good, fun thing to do. And uh, I encourage you to do it, too. Anyway, this is Newman at Home. And I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you want more updates on this CB radio setup, you can definitely comment that. Or you can also give me pointers on how to make my CB radio even better. How to make it the greatest. That would be swell. I really would approve it. So anyway, have a great day.